Hello guys, K here, and today I'm making a tutorial because I've received endless messages on how to do this and so on. So yeah, uh, the tutorial is, as it says in the title, how to record Minecraft without lag with fraps. So yeah, here it is. So, K. Now, most of you, uh, fraps should run in a decent amount. It would run like quite smooth now, right? But this isn't what. But uh, by the way, this isn't how my fraps normally run. It's because I'm recording my frame. Um, frame. My screen right now is going down. But fraps normally run. I mean, this normally runs without frap. Um, Camtasia on. I mean, uh, about good 150 or something. But is to record with fraps, you're gonna want to have a base frame rate of 90 at least. So yeah, I just thought I'd tell you that now. And here are my video settings. So you're gonna want graphics and fast, smooth lighting off, 3D anaglyph or whatever that is <laughs> off, GUI skill that's personal preference, and max FPS. Bobbing, I don't find that to affect it too much. And advanced open GUI, you're gonna want uh, that on. So yeah. And now what you're gonna want to do is close Minecraft. Uh, and open the frap screen. Now when you record, um, you can have your video catch a hotkey to anything really. But I have mine to half size and 25 frames. 25 frames is a good one because it's not too... Um, how, what's the word I can use for it? Uh, jumpy, but um, it's quite smooth. So, yeah. And all this stuff, that's personal preference, that's game sound, that's your mic. And this is just all other stuff you want it to display on your screen. Now, the first thing I do, um, well, you can do to speed up the process is get this program called Gamefile. This will tell you your system status and so on, and it will display all the other stuff. Well, I don't have a, a lot because I like to keep my two cores in my laptop not used a lot because I only have a dual core laptop, but yeah. So here you can see all my stuff but yeah now we want to have this gaming mode enabled so uh, how you wanna have when you download this program it's gonna ask you about a gaming profile and here's my gaming profile you can pause the video while you go through this so you might wanna see this and this is basically it and if you're on a laptop make sure you have high performance on I can't stress that enough Okay, and it's about it. Okay, uh, don't you think there's anything much besides the game profile? You'll notice when you record, this will happen, and your PC could, in your opinion, look like crap. One sec, I have to send a text message. Uh, um, mm, mm, mm. Yeah, why well, that does that? See, it gets back that much of my RAM, which is good, but yeah. Uh, so now that's done, I shall send this text after. Now that's done, what you want to do is... Hmm, you could open Minecraft or you could go to the task manager and find Fraps. Now Fraps isn't there for me, but when I open Fraps... That's not Fraps, wait, where's Fraps? Uh, Fraps... I forgot which one it is. But for an, for an example, I'm just going to do this, and you can just set it to higher. And that will like make it uh, to have a high performance, basically. And besides that, what you want to do is close all background applications besides Fraps and Minecraft. Uh, maybe Skype if you are doing a dual com. You, don't, you, want, you want to keep that open, so yeah. And instead of recording full screen, what you want to do is drag it out here. If you want to have it as decent quality, drag it about about there, and you shall have decent quality. Um, this does vary depending on your PC's resolution, but here's my one. And as you can see, that's a decent size to record in. And because on Fraps, ugh, wait, Fraps, we've selected half size it's going to be like half of this in your final file 
and also to speed up the fraps process what you want to do is if you have a usb an external hard drive you want to set it to record straight to that so as you can see mine's set to record on my external hard drive which is which is 1.5 terabytes but it only shows that for whatever reason i don't know actually no they always do that with hard drives that's not the point and so on so yeah um there's not really much else besides well you don't exactly need big icons that this also seems to speed up the process a little by the way um you can get rid of that and having a one color background improves it a lot now because my computer is decent i don't need that well it's not decent it's actually great for a laptop but yeah here's my specs and so on also that reminds me in uh, august time i might be getting a new computer and this computer could either be a Mac, which is going to cost about 1.4k, or um, a gaming PC, but yeah. And here's my screen resolution. As you can see, there. And the lower the resolution, it could run smoother, but obviously, the lower the resolution, the quality could get worse if you're doing half size think that's all for this and yeah and just in case you were going to ask I might be getting a Mac not because I do art in school and yeah because it would help my GCSE a lot so yeah I don't think there's anything else so bye guys and you will never see what's in this folder until I get 1k this will remain a mystery to you goodbye <laughs>